This is the rear. Um, this is a pretty stock uh, ride height, I would say. You can see the coilovers there, but I think this gap is, is pretty stock here. Same thing for the front. The front might be a little bit more aggressive, as you can see there. Um, this one has a little bit of the same gap. You know, it's kind of stock-ish. Um, let's move over to the other side. Something happened with the camber on the other side, so I don't know if the uh, the crash bolts are tight enough. I didn't tighten them, tighten them, so this is 100% what it could be. But the camber on this is like, whoa, whoa, where'd my tire go? Whoa. But uh, we're going to adjust that at some point. Um, but same thing goes for the back one. The back one kind of looks eh, the, kind of the same. It's kind of cambered in a little bit uh, compared to... Uh, the passenger side here, so we're gonna we're gonna go for both. Uh, I got this nice little fancy gadget here that will uh, let me set my camber to zero, so it's gonna be pretty good. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and use that. I'm gonna go ahead and use the uh, smaller jack. I only got three bolts on on each uh, wheel, just so then it'll be easier for me to take off, so then I don't have to worry about taking five off. And uh, we're going to go ahead into this, guys. So we're going to jump into another time lapse.